What's up, Crypto Miners? We went and got one of these Founders Edition uh, 3060 Ti's to add to the mining run. Now, if you're looking for 3060 Ti's, you will have a problem of finding LHR cards. Now, you can either buy an LHR card, yeah, or you could buy... A... I'll tell you at the end. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you at the end. <laughs> Make your wait, yeah? Right, so you can buy a 3060 Ti Founders Edition. Now, the Founders Edition aren't uh, hash rate limited as, you know, that could be untrue, you know, but uh, uh, supposedly they're not. Yeah, they're 100% supposed to be not LHR because they are the Founders Edition by NVIDIA. Right, so obviously the PCBs are different. Yeah, and the board, yeah, or the chip is, you know, the ones that are binned. Yeah, like the bin chip means the better ones, right? So I went ahead and got one, right? Obviously, I've never owned a Founders Edition uh, 3060 or any Founders Edition GPU, you know? So we went and got a 3060 Ti. It obviously doesn't fit in front of the box. So I kind of wanted to just do an opening and just. Uh, take a look at it like see what the call is like you know see you know if it's any d like if it's decent or what yeah 3060 ti right so obviously i said so if you know about the lhr lhr cards right i do have one and they are a pain like because if you mess with the power limit right you know they go down yeah so uh the hash rate goes down so, I know MB Miner just put out an update yesterday uh, to go to 39.5, right? And the thing with 39.5 is, um, obviously, if you keep the power, if you lower the power, but what keeps happening to me is I keep getting some block, and it keeps saying LHR unlock, yeah? And then gets unlock, unlock, and then goes unlock, keep saying unlock, yeah? And then you keep the pirate 100% and I'm thinking, well, this is not very efficient for the hash that you're getting. So I use it on a different, I use it on an excavator or something like that. Oh, yeah, this is actually pretty sick, dude. Jeez. Yeah. Woo-hoo-hoo. <laughs> First time seeing this type of card. But obviously this is the 3060 Ti, right? Uh, we do seem to have a copy heat, heat pipes in there. As you can see, there's three of them, yeah? I reckon they're coppers. You know, they should be copper, yeah? So, this is real heavy. Wow. This is real heavy, yeah? Uh, more heavier than I expected for just a two-fan cooler, but obviously this seems to be a beast. Right. So that is the 3060 Ti. Yeah, nice card, man. Nice card. I do, I do, I do not like the the pin input. I do think the pin input is a bit bob, right? And I do think that it should be like at the very end of the card or at the back, you know, so you can kind of route the power out of the system and not see it. But obviously, we're mining with it, so we don't care. The, the power input is in the middle but if this was in a personal system and you was using this as a like to game on ooh I'd be kind of a bit like you know I like looking at the PC like yo do my PC out like you know <laughs> I think everyone gets that kind of a thing right so that's the uh, GPU um, right so aha that's our power input so it is one eight pin and it's this weird thing to an eight pin. Um I don't understand what why they would make something like this. Why wouldn't they just make it an eight pin PCB? Uh you know, something dodgy there, like Right, and then all you get in the box is like a start guide and you know, this is pretty much it. So what does it say? Hold on. It says use only included power connector using third party power connector may void your manufacturer's warranty right well 
I don't care about that. What? Oh, I don't care about like their uh, their nonsense. Like you know. Uh, yeah, nice box. Quick opening. Yeah, it's like a triangle insert for anyone who wants seen the 3060 Ti. So, if you're still here, if you're looking to buy a 3060 Ti, or you're looking to buy an LHR card. I could advise, instead of buying a 3060 Ti LHR, buy a 2070 Super. Yeah. Obviously, they do about the same hash rate as a non-LHR card, but they're more power efficient. Yeah, you can get them down to around 99 watts. If, depending on the card you have, depending on the power pins that you have into that specific card, um, myself, I am looking for like a 2070 Super, so I will end the video here. That's basically the people who wait to the end. Thanks for watching. Peace.